Hello YouTube, welcome to another video. So recently I made a video on how to add more games to the TV game stick. Okay, so currently is one of my videos with more views and more likes because it works. Okay, so but what happens if you have your card already full so imagine you have a 60 a 32 gigabyte card and you want to to change to a 64 gigabyte card in this video i'm going to to tell you or to teach you how to do it so i'm currently doing it on this tv game stick which is also reviewed on my channel uh, so it says there M logic, but it's not M logic, so it's a fake. Uh, so the Chinese painted over the CPU. I think this one is RK CPU. Okay, doesn't matter. So I found an image that comes mostly empty, just a few games, and so I changed the team, and I noticed that for this one, if I had games directly on the folders they will show on the main list which is what I was looking for because on the other video in order we launch the games we have to put them inside a random folder and then launch through the the file explorer in this version no you can put the games directly on which folder you want and it will show over here and also if you put the picture of the game with the same name it will so it was it will also show you the picture okay so this is working really well so and i made the changes so to show my channel logo blah 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 but this is for me so um i did it for me i also changed the the logos of the the emulators okay so and in this video so let me show you the version so the firmware version i don't know if this was changed so this it says there another youtube channel and yeah so i don't take credits for the image i only changed the the, the thumbnails of the, the emulators and stuff okay so as I told you so I saved that image on a 16 gigabyte card but uh, imagine I want to do a card bigger so I want to instead of 16 I want to have 64 gigabytes and put all my ROMs on the, the correct folders with time, with pictures, blah, 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 everything. So I can do it, okay? So let's do it. So let me show you. So I told you that this image comes uh, with just a few games for testing. And so just to show that if I had another game, so we don't, if you don't know Mario Adventure 3, go read about it so you can come here with your ROM and patch it and then you will have uh, this game Mario Adventures 3 okay so here you choose your ROM then you patch it and you will have the game so I already patched mine and then I downloaded the thumbnail which will be this one so let's move it inside the Famicom folder and now I'm going to show you that uh, the if we plug the the card, it doesn't show it has 16 gigabyte. So let me open Disk Genius, and then if I select the the micro SD, you see it, it has several partitions, but the one we need is the last one. And you see, I have a lot of space free and the games are only on this small space okay so what we need to do is to extend 
that part okay but it, i will do it on, on the bigger card because i will clone the this card to one with 64 gigabytes and for that i will be using this tutorial that i made that's how, how i did it so i clone my current card my current tv game stick installation with this video that i will be showing you it's uh, i did it some time ago so it's at the bottom of my channel so let me find it but i will link it in the video description for you it's simpler okay where is it ah it's here so you see so this one this is how you can create an image from your card and then you burn it to another card okay so this is how i did it so i read the 16 gigabyte image imagine you have one card that uh, so your purchase from aliexpress the card came with 32 gigabyte and you want to to do a clone to a 128 gigabyte card you will clone it so you create an image on your on your computer and then you will burn it with the same application on that tutorial to the new card but you see so it will take only 16 and the rest will be free so we need to extend this partition and doing that the totality of the card will be used and so we will have a lot of space to put our our roms our games inside and that's how you expand your partition okay so if you have a clone from 32 to 64 or from 6 32 to 128 gigabytes you can extend because the, if you do a clone it will be exactly as the same one so you need to extend the partition and after that you see that the totality of the card is yours and now we have a huge partition that we i can move games inside okay now i'm going to show you that the game that i moved inside that partition is fully working don't forget if you are learning something with this video to give it a thumbs up okay that's how youtube knows that the video is interesting and it should show you show the video to more people okay so once again it's loading so now let's go to famicom which would be this one and now if i go below it's the last one so mario adventure it's loading and it's running so it works so you can put games inside it will read directly and yeah that's how that's how you clone that's how you extend and that's how you put more games on your tv stick so don't forget if you enjoyed the video if you learned something today to give it a thumbs up and if you are new to the channel consider to subscribe and if your tv stick is different from this one check the other video when I, where i show how to put more games because it works for every every game stick if they have the the file explorer available okay so i'll catch you on a new video bye bye